Hey guys. Welcome to Couple. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. In 2015, Cindy Eckert, then Whitehead, made headlines after landing a billion dollar deal for the company she co-founded, Sprout Pharmaceuticals, which developed female libido boosting drug Adii. It was far from a fairy tale exit though, the company that acquired Sprout was plagued with problems and, ultimately, the business was given back to Eckert and its former shareholders for free. Now, Eckert and Sprout are getting something rare in the world of Start UPS, a second chance. People think I had a billion dollar exit, there was a billion dollar happy ending. Well, it didn't go that way, Eckert, 44, tells CNBC make it but it taught me the power of my own resolve. Eckert co-founded Sprout Pharmaceuticals with her then-husband Robert Whitehead in 2011 to acquire a medication called Flyvanseran. With it, Sprout developed Adii, dubbed Female Viagra, to treat hypoactive sexual desire disorder in premenopausal women, 10% of all women suffer from HSDD. Eckert was named the CEO in January 2015 and, just days after Adii won FDA approval that August, public company Valine Pharmaceuticals acquired Sprout Pharmaceuticals for $1 billion. To sell a company is both exhilarating and excruciating, says Eckert. And the excruciating piece is, it's in so many ways part of you, and to be able to step out of that and watch it, is difficult, and often heartbreaking. Like when things go wrong. The sale soured. The lead became mired in a scandal concerning its accounting practices, and Adii, the price of which Valine had doubled, was denied coverage by many insurers, despite Viagra coverage, while also taking heat for its questionable effectiveness. In 2016, Eckert and former Sprout shareholders sued the pharma giant, alleging that it failed to market the pill successfully and overcharged consumers. In November, Valine gave Sprout back to its original shareholders for nearly nothing in exchange for them dropping the lawsuit. Valine also provided the shareholders with a $25 million kickstart loan, according to Bloomberg, with Valine to receive a 6% royalty on global sales of Adii beginning in 2019. Now, Eckert who says she is the largest shareholder in Sprout is back as CEO, she was pushed out after the sale to Valine. And she's using round two to implement ambitious plans for Little Pink Pill Adii, including making the drug more accessible to women who suffer from low libido.